name is Dan Peer. I'm the head of the laboratory of nanomedicine at Tel Aviv University. I was educated at Tel Aviv University, did my PhD here, my master and my bachelor. Then I moved to Harvard Medical School where I pursued my postdoctoral uh, position there. And I was recruited back in 2008 to establish the lab of nanomedicine. Uh, our lab is focusing on trying to manipulate cellular function in order to generate novel therapeutic approach to treat mainly leukocytes implicated diseases. It means blood cancers, inflammation and viral infection. We are also very uh, interested in a very subtype of aggressive tumors, solid tumors such as ovarian cancer and brain tumors such as glioma. So this is our cluster particles. You can see tiny particles. Inside you have chemotherapy or any therapeutic payload. It can be RNA molecules, it could be proteins. And uh, so it gives you a variability and it could be joint. Actually, we can interrupt different type of, of therapeutic payloads inside those particles. And it have a special coating. And this coating goes only to cancer cells and not to healthy cells. It will bind only to cancer cells by a natural mechanism. And when we inject it systemically into a blood vessels, it will reach the tumor through an enhanced permeability and retention effect. Basically, you see that those uh, blood vessels are more leaky here, and the tumor is these guys. So the first step will be extravasation of the payload into, specific, uh, into the specific area of the tumor, or vicinity of the tumor. But then it will bind specifically to the cancer cells and then release those tiny particles with the therapeutic payload. So this is a kind of a revolution in the drug delivery area because until now we had only single particles and that were approved clinic for clinical use. Now we are talking about cluster of particles and the variety and the amount of payloads is increased.